Hey everybody and welcome back to the Terraria Calamity Melee series. Now, this video is going to be starting off a little different. Just a little. So, I'm actually going to go into my main world where I've been playing all day. This is my, um, kind of, I don't have so much more help on this one. Maybe that's something I should change. Anyway, um, so I've been kind of playing on this throughout the day. Um, in my off time, I haven't done any recording today. I've just been posting because I recorded yesterday. Um, and I just want to... I've gotten to a boss that I cannot seem to defeat. First of all, the battle arena that I'm using, I did get from a YouTuber, um, Python GB. so the credit for this arena goes to him. Not about stealing ideas. It was just an arena that um, I liked, and it was huge. So I did use his... Build. So all credit for this does go to him. Um, so the Devourer of Gods. I would like to say that I started out playing today at um the uh, I think I started off at Golem. I think so. I've just been playing all day since Golem. And here's the boss that I, I literally cannot seem to beat. <sighs> so this is a rogue loadout that I'm rogue loadout that I'm using. Um, I was about to start. Normally I can do this first phase, somewhat easy. And I, okay, that's not gonna be our only run. That was bad. That was a warm up. Um, this will not be the whole video, by the way. I will be going back to our actual world. I just want to show, like, just how worried I am for this boss when I do get to it. Um, it genuinely scared the crap out of me the first time I fought it. Like, I was like, what the heck is this? And it's, he has so much health. And it's just so hard to... Mm. Luckily, there's no way for him to enrage. You can find him anytime, anywhere. So, he does. There's no way for him to enrage because I can't even imagine a enraged version of him. It's just so dang difficult. And you can see that I'm trying to use the Soul Strike. After I use the cell strike, I do a few more hits, and then I stop and let it charge back up. Dang it, I almost, I had adrenaline, I had it, and then I lost it. That is the worst feeling in the world when that happens. So, I've gotten a somewhat decent handle on his first phase. And then we get to the other phases, and it's just... So this is the second phase, he starts doing lasers a lot bigger on the screen. He starts chasing after you a little bit more, he summons in other little dudes to fight for him. He starts doing that, although I think he already has done that at this point. And he says, don't get cocky. Oh, okay, let me charge this up. Okay, that was some good damage. And so soon he's gonna enter his third stage, and you get like a little break in the fight. Alright, so here's where you can just have like a little break. Until... That opens up, he's gonna come out, he's huge now, you can't damage him for like the first few seconds. And then you can, you know, attack him as you do. And he does a whole lot more damage now, he chases after you a whole lot worse. I mean, he gets to around 80 health, or 80,000 whatever. I swear, he does this attack that is, it, it's impossible to dodge. And I will forever stand by this fact. It's 
it's just, it's not possible. It'd be nice if the first time I beat him was actually on video. I'd like that. I, I sincerely doubt it was going to happen, but... I almost had adrenaline, whatever. Okay, this. Lasers literally... Mm, they're all over the screen. Oh my gosh. Wait, I literally have never gotten this far. Hang on, hang on. Hang on. Dang it. <laughs> and there's like all these little audio things that go up. But he's like, delicious. And it's just like, ugh. Anyways. <laughs> so that's, that's, that's what we have coming up. Uh, any of you who <laughs> would like to know what's coming up. So, in terms of our progression, next we have the Poltergeist. Which we have to get some necroplasm for. First of all, can I... Is this bot sold by operator? Is this true information? Because sometimes it's not true. And it looks like it's not true. It sucks. Okay. Which does mean we have to go to the... Um... Uh, uh, dungeon to... Get it. Oh, no. oh, I defeated Providence. It's lost the episode to test out my new weapon. I should have emptied everything out. Anyways, we are just after Necroplasm, although we do need, like, a whole lot of it. Although I do believe there is, like, a way for him to spawn out, really. I don't quite know what that is. I just happen to have necro the necroplasm in my inventory. But so basically, the poltergeist is like a hard mode Plantera, or like a harder version of Plantera. And I didn't know that just from watching a video of it. Um, I have to get used to the fact that I can spam again. I've been playing Rage. Oh, you have to, like, hit him with this weapon. Something I didn't really realize. I, you have to hit him with one of the circles. It's extremely effective, though. And so here's what I'm thinking. I need to clear out an arena for it. So whilst I'm clearing out an arena, we can farm for them. What even drops the necroplasm? I don't even know. Okay. Let's... Go. This weapon does not seem to be that good for non bosses. Oh, there's some. I don't think I can switch to my minor so I'm going to have to switch back to too often. Okay, we're getting some. Um, so, this video is going to go up the day after I'm recording it, so I'm recording it on the 11th, so this will go up on the 12th, 
um, around when I wake up. But then I'm going to be gone for tomorrow and the following day before I come back home. So it'll be like a day where there is nothing. But then once I'm back home, I'll record and put some videos out. So wait, can we craft the, um, something I haven't even looked at? Because now that I've defeated... So now that I've defeated the moon, this should be something that we can craft. So we need these things. Um, and so basically it should allow us... Now I am going to have a limitation to it. I don't know exactly what it does, but my assumption would be that we can put stuff into our magic sword system from any point in the world. I'm not going to allow myself to do that. That's infinite inventory and it feels just too cheating. What I am going to allow myself to do is craft anything from anywhere I'm at, as well as, um... As well as get anything out from wherever I'm at. But then I, of course, cannot put it back in if I don't have any sort of space to get something else, get something out, then tough luck. Um, these are just a little. I have no way to enforce this. Good. Okay, I realized that I did not meet, so there's you. Conversation.
bro, why does this keep on happening? I'm like, I'm, I'm so annoyed at this. Why does this keep on happening? I do not understand. Because after I talked to my brother, like my mic was literally on. I literally even said, I guess you get some conversations between me and my brother now. I've not tabbed out of my screen a single other time. What is the, give me a second. Just in case that's saying anything, I don't freaking know. I doubt it's saying anything. Whatever. I'm annoyed. I don't know how long there hasn't been audio. But whatever. I can't I can't change it now. It's like it's not like there's anything that I can do. We're on to the Devourer of Gods. Which is where I'm at in my personal playthrough. Like I can't believe I like this was not my plan. I didn't realize how close we were to fighting this guy on here too. But it seems to be a lot easier on here than it seems to be on my rogue. Maybe rogue is just a really dreaded class. I don't know. A lot of people say that the rogue class is stupid and incredibly difficult and, you know. And it's kind of the point, you know. It's, it's a calamity exclusive class. Like, of course it's gonna be hard. But literally, this boss fight seems so much easier as a melee character than as... Bro, I don't know if it's because I have more defense or, or what, but... I got a new accessory... ...that basically gives me a bunch of stuff so, so long as I have that little circle filled up on the left side of my screen. Uh, third stage, I believe this is. Wait for him to come out, and then can't hurt him for a minute. Yes, yes. I know you don't think it's over yet. I'm gonna get adrenaline. Touching his skin. There's so much damage in this stage. <laughs> this stupid, undodgeable stage. Whatever. Maybe I should grab the nurse. I don't even know. Like, is the nurse even gonna help me? I I can't... I don't know whether to build more platforms or like do a much much bigger battle arena. Cause I don't just want this video to be me fighting the same boss over and over, losing over and over and over again and not winning at all. And like I'm I know I'm improving. Like the first time I fought this guy, dude, I died within seconds. Not having infinite flight though, that is a challenge. Because when I start falling, you know, there's nothing I can do. And if I land on his skin during that stage, he does his skin does so much damage. So it's like I don't know what to do. Trust me, I'm not getting cocky. I'm not getting cocky until you have 
3,000 health left. Even then, I really just still might lose. Because who knows what your stage is at that point. I certainly don't know. Okay. I can consistently get to this stage of the fight. That was bad. That was just, that was bad. There's no other way to screw that. That was just bad. Like, what am I supposed to do? When he circles me around like that, like... Bro. Oh my god. I can consistently get to that stage. But after that, it's like, what the frick do I do? Like, literally, I'm gonna build a huge platform. Um... Dryad, where are you? I'm like looking for you, so I'm literally just gonna go to every single farm on build. Till I find you. And if you try to avoid me, I assure you, you'll lose. Is she gonna be the last? Of course she's gonna be the last. Bit. I'm using all of these before I pop the boss. And it's gonna start right here. I'm sorry that this is probably not gonna be the most entertaining content. Because I am, like I have every intention to use all of these. To give myself an incredibly long platform to fight this guy on. I don't know if that's gonna help. I might have to do a second platform. Maybe I can do two platforms that are both 3,000 blocks. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put this second half and sorry that this is not gonna be the most entertaining content. But like I don't know what to do. Like, I don't just want to repeatedly fight him, repeatedly lose, and just kind of do that on repeat. Like, that's not what I want this video to be. Do your job, Elemental. Dude, what are you doing? You're gonna let him get to me. How dare you. I'm gonna put some music on for this because I. <laughs> Everybody, do what you wish. Skip to this part. I would, I would personally, I would skip to this part. No hard feelings. Oh, right, actually, though, hang on. Genuinely, I need a phone charger. No, I'm bluffing. I'm not gonna do this whole thing. This might be long enough. I'll just extend it if I still fail. 
I'm gonna do a layer on top. Dude, even without my melee loadout, this thing still does a thousand and twenty five damage. If this doesn't work, I'm going to try adding a middle platform. I'm gonna take a move in silence. First time I got hit. How'd you know? That was a good devourer of God. I feel like I'm doing worse with the platform. Maybe I'm relying on the straightness of it a little bit too much. Maybe I just. Oh my gosh, you know what, I'm a real dummy. I had the wrong freaking loadout on, so if I lose, that's, that's why.
Dang, I got him to a second stage when being in the wrong freaking loadout for half of the battle. That it gives me oh that feel that makes me feel good. Oh my gosh. Come on, I can almost heal. I can so I'm so close to being able to heal. No, and then we get this stage, lovely. Oh my gosh. Okay. To be fair, I was in the wrong loadout for half of that battle. So... I wonder if, um... If nothing else, it gives me a little bit of extra defense. But I'm hoping it'll increase my flight time slightly. <laughs> okay. Dude, I got so close. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna add one more platform. Actually, I'm gonna add two more. Oh, dang, look. I'm gonna add two more. I'm gonna add one in the middle. No, I'll just start with one in the middle. 
I forgot how many blocks this thing is. Alright, if I were to go here. Wait, actually, let me. Because I'm OCD. Okay. So we should have 45. 45. Yeah, it does not matter. I'm just gonna go here. Also, it looks pretty good. Now, if I do this, 45, oh my gosh, this is perfect. And, uh, Oh, so everything's like failing to load. Forty-seven. Forty-seven. Okay, this is the exact middle. Actually, that might be a very valid strategy. Try and zoom out. What does it look like? So I can't see the watch as well. But... And we're gonna have, like, bad... Oh no, it looks fine. So it's just gonna have trouble living in. I think I can deal with that. But I'm gonna get you to just the boss of that. Okay. Oh my gosh, my space bar was stuck. 
So I can get out of the frame. I think that's... Dude, if I... If I had the Rod of Discord, we'd be covered. If I don't do this, I might actually try and get the Rod of Discord. Because I don't think I can get hit inside of that frame. Oh my god. I swear I can do this. Bro. Let's go hold out a little bit longer and then I can potion. Oh my gosh. Dude, I had him at 19,000. Hang on, okay. I just want to crouch one. Fifteen. I I, I don't think it was this easy. Wait, do I have everything for that? Okay, I think I only need light. Yeah, I only need light. Having the wrong Discord, I think, is going to help. Because, I don't know if you guys actually can tell what I'm talking about. Whenever we're fighting him, the zoomed out all the way, I can see the frame in which the lasers appear. If I can rot of Discord out of the frame, then we're golden. And just to show you guys what I mean, so it says, can we shimmer into the Rod of Harmony? That is a function that you can do after you fight, after you beat the Moon Lord. You can see that it's not doing it. I don't know why, but it's doing it, so. But I hope that this will help. Alright, let's zoom out as far as we can, which seems to be the- Look how tiny I am. Okay. No, let's not zoom out that much. Let's go like about right here. Okay. I couldn't play like this all the time, but... You see how there's like a frame? That they spawn in? If I get out of that frame, I'm good. When he goes invisible, that's my chance to try and get in there directly and do a lot of damage. Okay, crap. We're incredibly damaged.
Wait, why is it 15 seconds? What? Bro, what? Alright, it's about to do. Alright, well that changes things a little bit. It still helped, dude. It still helped so incredibly much. Alright, now I'm trapped. Oh crap, I don't know how to fight. I'm gonna almost heal. I'm... Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. So during a boss fight, apparently, you can only do it every 15 seconds. Which I think is stupid, but I kind of understand why. I feel like a lot of these bosses could be cheese with the Rod Mistors. And this is definitely one of them. Because he likes to engulf you. In his body. And then, you know, I really destroy you. Yes, I was just taking some hits because look at how much damage I just did against him. Or whatever this thing is. It doesn't even deserve a gender. Just kidding. He's annoying though. Oh my gosh, I got off to the thing. Okay. We're at full health. Whoa! What? That was kind of stupid, in my opinion. Dude, I don't. This isn't fair. Eesh. Oh my gosh. No. Oh my gosh. Wait, we still have a bomb just for use. We're about to get a potion use. Oh my gosh. Come on, come on, come on. Hold out, hold out, hold out, hold out. Hold out. Come on, hold out. Oh my gosh. Remember, if I need to use the rod, just Oh my gosh, I switched. Okay, it's fine. I barely got hurt that time. Uh, bro. I'm so... Oh my gosh, we got five digits. <sighs> come on, come on, bro, please, 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 please. Oh my god, oh my god. What's happening? <laughs> Why is the second one out?
Never, never, never again. Ten percent increased momentum into hiding nebula stars to protect you. You will survive an attack that would have killed you and healed up 100 HP. This effect has a nice thing for that. Hello. <laughs> What's this do? Oh yeah, for sure get rid of that. Dude, I got like a weapon that I can't even use. That was my break. I cannot believe I Hallelujah dude. This is this is this is a This is a relic. Oh Dude, what I'm really worried about I don't ever want to have to fight him again, but here's what I'm worried about. How much is this treasure bag? 2600. I can buy one. <sighs> Honestly, just for the Cosmolite bars. Dude, I cannot. Oh my gosh. What all can I do with these beautiful bars that I got here? <laughs> I can do a whole bunch of stuff. Alrighty. Alright, so first of all, we can up, we can combine, I think, two accessories that I, do I, Ancient Spirit. First of all, let's craft the Cosmic Anvil. How does one do that? Where is the Cosmic Anvil at? I can't find it. There it is. Ten Luminite. I don't have that. I'm literally going to put them in Lord. Which means I think I'm going to have to actually go through. I can't find my dang summon for it. Yeah, it should be right around here. Cause here's all the summons and it's not here. Oh, what's that? That's hilarious. Nope, can't read it. So what I'll do is this is a 10 luminite to an astral bars. Let me see if I have this. Gal. Oh my gosh, I have to do the pillars anyway. Let's just, let's just do it. I don't want to do this. But, but we're we're just gonna we're just gonna pull through. We're gonna do it. Cause I need I I need the stuff on it. Cause I mean technically I could just use all the other fragments to craft some solar fragments, but I die. You're not even gonna be a challenge, dude. Like, let's get that clear. Like, you are- Oh. So, Lynn, cultist, remember when I barely survived? <laughs> oh, I got- I got it. I got it. Heart. Oh, no, I've already consumed it. First pillar. I think I have a texture pack that changes what the pillars look like. I'm not for sure. But I think I do. Let's find out. Oh yeah, I do. <laughs> look at how cool it looks. This should be incredibly easy. Speaking out loud. Speaking from experience, 
Why is it only 50? I thought it was 100 at least. I'm not even playing anything. It just makes this man a lot easier and shorter and... It's so insane. How quickly I can destroy everything. I want to get all of the fragments. Next one! Honestly, it's probably just closer to walk. Hi, Crimson! I'm meteorite. I'm so beyond you. I love the new pillars. They look so cool. I also mentioned this would getting me money, so I don't hopefully not have to fight the stupid. Destroy your gods again. I mean, I'm gonna have to, but once I get enough equipment to where, you know, it's not the hardest thing I've ever had to do in this freaking game. The, 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 the drawer of gods needs to be seriously buffed. It needs to be, and I don't mean like he needs to be upgraded, no, he needs to be ungraded. He's, he's too difficult. Don't get me wrong, I've had a really easy challenge with some of the bosses, or a really easy time with some of the bosses, and I've thought, like, they need to be a little bit harder. That was beyond too much. I can't even imagine having to do that in death mode or master mode or master death mode. Cannot imagine it. And I'm, you know, officially back to being farther than my other account. So that's fun. This pillar's taking a lot longer, I don't like it. I like how quickly the other ones went. So much broken terrain and whatnot here. Okay. Also, the pillar one seems cool. I remember this one was on top of the cheese. Yeah.
Now it's got like this dumb thing to spawn. So I'm gonna craft my second. Hang on a second. This is also a text pack. Personal best, look at that. Ah. Ooh. Ah, uh, some of the new designs. Okay. So now, where were we? Oh my gosh. Interesting. And craft Illuminati out of the stuff he drops. Anyways, so now, I do believe we should now be able to craft the, I need to craft an anvil. I should hopefully now be able to craft the Cosmo, oh my gosh, I still can't. <sighs> Okay, what do I not have? Oh, I don't have the gal. Oh yeah, I should be able to craft it now. Cosmo, bro. <laughs> All right, we have a mithril. We have the Cosmolite bars, we have the Luminite bars, we have the Gal whatever, and then we, we so it must be this. Exo... Cluster. I, I got this cluster stick. Oh wait, can be shimmered. Give me one moment to figure out how the heck I get these. I don't know, it tells me the enemy right there, but I don't know what enemy that is. Oh, it's an ore. And planet toads. Yeah. 
Maybe... Uh, let's go look at the planet toys. I feel like I remember seeing like a um, Luminite filled um, planetoid, and I think, oh yeah, it's a DM. Wait, is that what it is? Hang on. And I can get all the way up to the St. Link. Oh, wait. Hi. Anyways, let me zoom in just a little bit. Where's this thing at? A little bit this way. I even use that. Not that close, my bad. Okay, yeah, I think this has gotta be it. Sorry, let me. Okay. It's gonna fall, and that's fine. <laughs> so I think that's probably plenty. But there seems to be another one right here. So, uh, you know, naturally. <laughs> this is so satisfying. Dang it, stop. Oh my gosh, it's so dang satisfying. This is limit, which is lame. Okay. So now I should, you know, once I get to the ground, eventually in a thousand years. Okay, cool. Should have a bunch on the ground. So now we're at 1,846. But there is this mysterious shaped thing up here. So let's go see what that is. I prefer to never have to worry about this item again. Where, where is that? It's over here. Dodge. <laughs> it almost doesn't seem fair because of the main line. But it is. It is so fair. It's so beautiful. I never have to fight Moon Lord again. <laughs> oh my god, it was another one. It's so beautiful. One more. I promise we'll be welcome. It's so sad my go. Okay, now let's jump to the ground. I wonder if I can shimmer it now. Oh my gosh, it's still dropping. I think I have a lot. <laughs> maybe, maybe just a little bit? I mean... Dude, do you really want to do this? Nope. Alrighty. Are we still gonna have some problems with this Cosmoy Anvil? There we go. That's why I thought. Now. What all 
all can I stop with this beautifulness? So, right off the bat, allows the ability to ram dash, empowered by Cosmo, Cosmic Inferno. This dash can flame through enemies without taking damage, grants immunity to knockback and fireblock, grants immunity to vast majority of defects, including God Slayer and Inferno. We gotta craft that, dude. So, first of all, I don't appear to have any of this on me. Do I have. Alright, so I need the Ink Shield. The Onyx. Alright, this. I think this is the Onyx. Um. Or, oh, or net. Okay. So, first, we're gonna need some Core of Calamity. Which I believe just requires having a bunch of these. Alright, and so now we need a core of calamity. We need to craft the ink shield again. Which, you know, should be easy enough. I just need to go buy every single one of the accessories. Because I doubt that I have it. And all of this can be put in here. The rest of the episode's probably not going to be lost well, so the rest of the episode really just might be upgrades. Just warning everybody now. Alright, where's where's the guy that... There's a guy who sells, like, accessories and stuff. So, are you it? Yeah, here we go, okay. So we need... Okay. I'm going to quickly borrow this because it's going to be easier. Alright, then we're going to craft a cobalt shield and obsidian. Goal. Which then we are going to craft into this. Why can I not craft the ink charm? Oh, because apparently you need other stuff in this mod. Okay, so we need. A frozen shield. Alright, I actually need one of these. But then I also need a paladin shield. Paladin can... Surely there's an easy way to get this. Frozen tier was here. Please, sell this thing. Are you, are you really gonna do this to me? Well, by Tinker. You are the Tinker, right? Oh, there it is. Cool, you scared me. Okay, so just while I'm here, we also need this. Which just requires this and then another thousand shield. Oh, this is exhausting. Okay. So now, we should have absolutely everything that we need. Craft. What 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 am I still tro having trouble with, dude? Why do we need a whole nether accessory? I swear we didn't need this before. Okay. 
There, ink charm, ink shield. Okay. That was a long process. Alright, so now, the ink shield. We need to craft. We need to go back to this. So we now have the ink shield, we now have the core of calamity. Now we need to craft this. Oh, which I should be able to craft already, yeah. Okay. So now. I should now be able to craft the Asgard's Valor. Okay. With this. So now we need to craft this thing. Which drops from Providence. So I should theoretically actually already have this. Do I really not? Nope, okay, so that means, guess what we get to do now? That's right, we get to craft, or we get to fight, the dang Providence. Don't worry, it shouldn't be hard, famous thoughts works. Like, famous thoughts works. Just because, you know, I've had a lot of trouble with this freaking boss and... Well, I turn my little angry that I'm literally destroying it. It'd be really embarrassing if we defeat the Devourer Gods but also him, just saying. Like, I don't think that's gonna happen. How many times am I gonna have to fight him to get the drop? He sh you should just, you know, give it to me first try. No, nope, we're gonna play it this way though. Okay. I'm fully finding him outside of the hollow biome. I'd be down to fight him at night. Okay, let me be kind of careful because I, I, I don't want the embarrassment to lose the boss after everything. Okay, cool. We're good. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Now, can you just give me what I'm looking for, please? Bro. She does actually drop this, right? Like, this is, this is a, like... Yeah, okay. I don't know the chances of her dropping it are. Look at me, not taking damage from your laser. <laughs> you really should just give me what I want. There will be a lot easier for you, for me. And for the audience, because then I have to see you take out the same boss. Over and 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 over I mean, I will. Okay, have you decided to come to your senses yet? Bro, come on, dude. This is... We're at, we're at three attempts on this. It's, 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 it's time that you tap me a seven and, and, and drop what I'm dang looking for. Yes, I know she's awoke and I summoned her. I want her to get more upgrades going, but uh, with you doing this, you know, I don't know how much time I'll have. Oh, goody, goody, good.
Are you gonna stop being stubborn yet? Bro. I had to have gotten every single drop other than this freaking. I'm gonna run out of daytime, I'm gonna have to put it at night time. I don't wanna do that. Oh yeah, I probably could. I wanna actually kinda of sound kinda of, kinda of fun. On the other hand, I don't wanna do it. I just want her to drop what I want her to drop. It's not like a master mode drop, is it? Cause this will be a good time. Oh my gosh. Is there any way to craft this stupid thing? Bro, I, I, I swear she's hacking. How have I literally, I haven't, okay, I haven't gotten the trophy yet. I haven't gotten this yet either. <sighs> okay. I just hit first line back at her. I would have been if I did that. I don't know if I could do that or not, but it would have been cool if I did. Got down to negative to minus two to three to one. Are you going to be nice and give it to me? Apparently not. Oop. They keep on playing this game. Remember, like, two videos ago and I couldn't defeat you? Yeah, me either. I feel like I'm talking like a vampire without my humanity. That's what I feel like I sound like. I could try and get a drone. No. Oh well. Bro, it's such a long Give me the dang left. Give me the dang accessory. Why are you being so stubborn? I literally got the trophy. I got the trophy. Which, well, is not a bad thing. That's ridiculous that I'm getting everything else. Like, we're, we're about to fight our eighth one. Freaking developer set. This is dumb. I don't understand. I'm actually kind of excited to fight her in the night time, but um, this is ridiculous. 
the thing. It is. Like, how many times have I fought her? Like, unless the mod has an error and it can only be a pain in my and it just won't tell me. Like, I should have gotten it by now. I got another developer set. I think I've gotten every single thing except this thing. No, my bad. I'm still missing a few things. Another developer set before I got this friggin' thing. Alright, time to fight him and Rage. For her and Rage, whatever. That's a lot more defense. He's blue. Ooh, that's a new move. Okay, so I'm gonna do damage. Is this gonna be like the first time I fought it, basically? What if it is like it's in rage drop? Like what if it's like the terror prism and you can only get it if you fight it in rage? That could be interesting. If that is the case, that's kinda cool. But uh, it means that I wish I hadn't wasted all my time fighting it in the daytime. Because you know. Oh my gosh, I might actually lose. That'd be a change. I'm a, I'm about to look this up. Why can't I get this thing accessory? Like it sh it should not require beating him. In the freaking night time. Because it, it's not gonna happen. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm upset that it's, it's not gonna happen. I'm really trying to let it kill me. Yeah. Full lasers, are you kidding me? Looking it up. What's it called that we need? The Aegis? A. E G I S. Suppose my lord says she does by when she is summoned in the. Oh. Okay, I'm glad I looked it up because I never would have come to that conclusion. I forgot you could fight her in the underworld. You know what? I'm dumb. Let's let's sleep first. Is she trying to come up to me? This is interesting. Oh. Okay. This is my good day, so I'm not finding her enraged.
That explains it. So, I've basically wasted so much time. Because I wouldn't look it up on the dang LP. Cheers. Why is the noise still there? Okay. This should be, you know, easy again. Now that I've gotten your trophy. Um I won't have to do much grinding with you in the future. All I need now is your mouse, which I might actually already have, I don't know. You're a little bit hard to attack down here. And you got some more defense down here, I think. Cause I feel like I would have already been down to fight. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna die now because I'm too stubborn. Nope, wait, I don't know, I don't know. Who's gonna die first? He's gonna die first. Barely, though. Hallelujah. everything for this. Oh, except this. I have to craft those. Whatever those are. Boom. Boom. And boom. Alright. Um, how does one to craft these? Alright, so we need Necroplasm. I have Nightmare Fuel. Is dropped. Okay, do I have that? Or am I literally gonna have to fight? <sighs> I have to fight the Honestly, okay. We're gonna pause on this until the next video. I'm tired, I'm gonna go to bed. This is clearly a very long process. So, thank you for watching, and until next time, goodbye.